obviously a, a tough opponent and not the result you all would have wanted, but you all stayed in it. Um, you were able to correct the first hit of the game. Uh, you had that single out to left. What was kind of going through your mind during that at bat trying to get a hit? Um, before that bat, I had talked to you, TJ and Paige, and they were just kind of really motivating me and giving me the confidence, confidence that I needed. And obviously, um, hope for North Texas is a really good pitcher, but we have really good pitchers on our staff and I face them all the time at practice. So I think I was really just kind of trying to build off that confidence and it's like, I've done it before I can do it again. And I was going to do it for my team. So that was just kind of going through my head. Hey Princess, this is Jared with the Daily News again. Um, I know you just said Hope's a really good pitcher, but what was it about, uh, I guess, what she was doing today that made her search out to hit? Um, she was spinning the ball really well today. And I think we kind of went into our bats knowing she was good and kind of got out, got ourselves out a little bit. She's obviously really good. So all the credit to her as well. But I think tomorrow we're gonna come back with more confidence and more, um, more confidence in our ability, knowing that we can hit good pitching. Hey, Princess Jake again. So I know it's not over for you all. You're all now on the double elimination portion of the tournament, um, coming to play either Charlotte or UAB tomorrow. Um, how is your team going to approach this game? I know you and, and coach and, and the team kind of had a decently long talk after the game, but what's the mindset you all are going to come in with tomorrow? Um, we're coming in ready for a dog fight. We're going to do everything we can to get these wins. We're obviously going to take it one game at a time and one pitch at a time and really try to slow ourselves down, but we're coming to win the win tomorrow and we're coming for Saturday. So for sure. Um, you know, you don't know exactly who you're going to play yet tomorrow, but you know it's either going to be UAB or Charlotte. Um, you know, two teams that you have played this year, um, swept UAB, I believe, in a non-conference series, as well as Charlotte. You know, how much do you think just having that experience against those two teams can help you in a game like tomorrow? Um, I think we're going to have a lot of confidence because we know we can beat both teams because we've done it before. I think we're just going to come in um, trusting our abilities and trusting in knowing, trusting each other and knowing that any team we get tomorrow, we're going to give it our best and leave it all on the field. Anything else for Princess? Sure. Thank you guys. Thanks. Yeah. Good luck tomorrow. Oh, sorry. Thank you. All right. We got Paige Carter here. Go ahead with questions when you're ready. Hey Paige, Jake here with the College Heights Herald. Obviously a tough loss for you all today going up against the number one seed in the tournament, um, going up against Hope, obviously a very fearsome pitcher, one of, if not the best pitcher in y'all's conference. Um, you were able to lay down that home run to left off of her to get your team on the board. Kind of walk me through what was going on during that at bat. Um, I jam got jammed on the inside and they ended up missing the pop-up. So I was like, all right, this is my chance to recover from their mistakes. Um, just, I moved up in the box. Uh, so I really tried to take away the curveball spin and being early. Um, so just try to take away the advantage that she has and just really try to connect and just wasn't going for a home run or anything, was just trying to get on base, but ended up hitting a home run. Hey Paige, this is Jared with the Daily News. Um, you know, I know Princess just said, obviously, Hope's a great pitcher. Um, and I know you had that home run, but you know, overall, I guess, what was it about her that made her so difficult to hit today? Um, I think we took ourselves out of, out of our at bats and everything. She is a very good pitcher and has great rise ball spin and curve ball spin. But I think we um, contemplated our swings today. We took too many good pitches that we should have been crushing and then we're swinging at the rise ball that was a ball. So I think we just took ourselves um, out of our at bats. I, I do give her credit. She is a very good pitcher, but we beat ourselves today even more. So you all aren't out of it yet. I know you come back tomorrow and play the winner of either UAB and Charlotte, uh, two teams you've already played before. Um, it's not over yet. Uh, one more chance to stay alive. Uh, how, how are you all going to approach the game tomorrow? What kind of mindset are you all going to bring in? Um, we're going to watch the game tonight and take notes of what they're doing against uh, the other team today. And then we uh, are also going to go back and look at the game film that we've had. I think it's a advantage that we've played both of them um, this year and we get to learn from our mistakes of what we've done hitting wise and like just taking notes of like where they pitch and how we could have done better to use in tomorrow's games.